Good morning, students. Welcome to Narayana Online Classes. In the previous class, we have learned how to find a rational number between them using mean method or average method or method number one. Now we are going to discuss the other two methods. So, how to find rational numbers between given two rational numbers? See, in the method one, rational number between A and B is A plus B by two. This method we have used and we have solved some five to six questions. In this session, we are going to see other two methods. How to find the rational number between two rational numbers a by b and c by d? Just add the numerators divided by sum of denominators. And in method three, how to find the rational numbers between a and b? For example, they are asking you to find n rational numbers between a and b. First, find the difference. How to find the difference? b minus a by n plus 1. b is the rational number, a is also given rational number, n is number of rational numbers required. If you use this formula, we will get d. That number you keep on adding to a so that we get rational numbers between a and b. Let's see how to find rational numbers using method 2. Find a rational number. Find a rational number between 1 by 2 and 3 by 5. Between 1 by 2 and 3 by 5. Solution. So here a by b is nothing but 1 by 2, c by d is nothing but 3 by 5. Rational number, rational number between a by b and c by d is a plus c by b plus d. Add the numerators 1 plus 3 by 2 plus 5 which is 4 by 7. So 4 by 7 lies between 1 by 2 and 3 by 5. So if at all you have a doubt you can clarify like this. What is the 1.1 by 2 in decimal form? 0.5. This is 0.5. 3 by 5 in decimal form? 0.6. So 4 by 7 in decimal form? 4 by 7 in decimal form? If you want to divide, divide 4 itself. If I keep decimal here, I will get 0. 7 5 is 35. 5, 0, 7, 7, 0, 49. If I leave here, it will be 0 0.57. 0 0.57 is greater than 0 0.50 and 0 0.57 is less than 0 0.60. Therefore, it lies between 1 by 2 and 3 by 5. So, we have verified also. Let's see one more question. Find the rational number between minus 5 by 3 and 1 by 2. Find the rational number between minus 5 by 3 and 1 by 2. So here a by b is minus 5 by 3 and c by d is 1 by 2. So rational number between a by b and c by d is equals to a plus c by b plus d minus 5 plus 1 by 3 plus 2 so minus 4 by 5 minus 4 by 5 means 0 0.8 see 5 by 3 means greater than 1 1 by 2 means 0 0.5 this is minus 1.66 and this is 0 0.5. 0 point minus 0 0.3 lies between these two, correct? Because it is very close to 0. This is greater than minus 1. This is greater than minus 1. If you check the number line, this is 0 and this will be 0 0.5. This will be minus 1. Somewhere it will be minus 2. Minus 1.66 lies here. Minus 0 point lies between 0 and minus 1. So, it lies between these two. Therefore, it is correct. Minus 0.8 lies between minus 1.66 and 
zero point five. If you don't want to verify, you can verify using this much also. Let's see one more rational number. Like one more question: How to find rational numbers using method three? Find five rational numbers. Find five rational numbers between seven and nine. Here, he has given a as seven, b as nine, and number of rational numbers are five. So m is equal to five. According to the formula, find d first. D is equal to b minus a by n plus one, nine minus seven by five plus one. B is nine minus a is seven by n plus one means five plus one. Therefore, two by six. If at all you want to write in simplest form, two ones, two threes, one by three. I got D. Now this D should be added to A so that we get the next rational number. Seven plus one by three. A plus D first. Seven plus one by three. Three seven zero twenty one. Three seven zero twenty one. It's a mixed fraction. We are converting into improper fraction. Three seven zero twenty one. Twenty one plus one twenty two. Twenty-two by three lies between seven and nine. First question. If you if you don't want to find second question number, for this number, add d. D is one by three, which is as the denominators are same, we can add the numbers. Twenty-three by three. If you want third question number. For the result number, add D again. As the denominators are same, we can add the numerators. 23 plus 1, 24 by 3, which is 8. See, 8 lies between 7 and 9, right? So what we have done is correct. Fourth rational number is the previous rational number plus difference B. 3 is the 24. Plus one, twenty-five by three. Fifth rational number is twenty-five by three plus one by three, twenty-six by three. So these are the five rational numbers between them. Now let's see whether we have done correct or not. Here we verify. Seven can be written as seven by one, right? I am going to write equal and rational number for this. Multiply both numerator and denominator with three. So why with three? Because everywhere denominators are three. Twenty-one by three. Nine can be written as nine by one. Multiply both numerator and denominator with three. Twenty-seven by three. Between twenty-one by three and twenty-seven by three. Twenty-two by three. Twenty-three by three. Twenty-four by three. Twenty-five by three. Twenty-six by three. Yes or no? So we have all the five rational numbers. Between twenty-one by three and twenty-seven by three. Twenty-one by three is less than twenty-two by three. Is less than twenty-three by three. Is less than twenty-four by three. Is less than twenty-five by three. Is less than twenty-six by three. Is less than twenty-seven by three. This twenty-one by three is nothing but seven. Three ones, three sevens. This twenty-seven by three is nothing but three ones, three seven, uh, three nines. Between seven and nine, one, two, three, four, five. These five rational numbers lies. So, hope you understand this question. Thank you. Have a nice day.